how do you reconcile chasing your own dreams and experiencing all of life while at the same time as putting your children in an environment for them to get the most out of life? Because at least growing up in Australia, for me, it's like there's a, being in, in an international relationship and I guess being in, living in different places from where you grew up, there's that constant pull that you feel like, where should I be and where is the best spot for my children? And just as in our careers, we think about where is the best spot for me in my career development that would set the example for the children. That's a great question. And I recently have had to make difficult decisions around this. First time in my life, I've made decisions as a father versus as a son or a brother. My wife and I made a decision recently to leave the Bay Area. That was a hard decision. My parents lived five minutes away. My sister lived five minutes away. My niece and nephew lived five minutes away. My brother-in-law, my family was there. But ultimately, you know, when I talk about the greed of experiencing life. I have lived life as a poor man. I have now lived life as a somewhat comfortable man. I have lived life as a son, as a brother, as a life partner. I've lived life as a founder. My children, specifically my children, because they're IVF children, they didn't ask to be here. So now I have to live my life as a father. And that's the only title that will never be stripped from me. My wife can divorce me and I'm single again. My children, I will die a father. And so it became very easy to put them at the forefront of my decision-making framework because the life experiences that I seek the most right now, the most above anything else, is memories with my kids. 